Different start to the day today. Today is the 2nd of January. I need to still pick up this stuff from Screwfix. Uh, and I also, I can't park up at the unit because the van's in the way and Stuart's got the van keys. So I've had to come to uh, my mum's house, which you'll see just outside the window there, to come and pick up the keys for the van. Gotcha. I started watching your video this morning, but about eight minutes in, I thought, bugger this, it's just rambling on. I never thought. Every time. I never thought. I never thought you'd leave me. So I thought, well, if I've not got the message yet from Screwfix, and I don't, it's now one o'clock, ten past actually, I thought I'd make something so we've got something to put in the vlog today. Now I've got a load of old floorboards and I've got that rack over there that I showed you earlier on. Now I was going to burn these floorboards but I thought why don't I make a lower shelf out of them. I've already done one and they've cleaned up pretty nicely. This is all tile lap. This was all taken from the ceiling up above us. It was holding on some plasterboards. It wasn't done very well. Out in the little yard, here we have the floorboards. Now I was just gonna burn these because some of them are really rotten, you know, but some of them are actually not too bad. And this is what I'm gonna be making. So I think that looks fine. The boards have cleaned up, I ran the planer over them quickly and it looks pretty smart. I reckon once they've got a little bit of stain on, I might just leave them as raw wood. They must have been treated with them being floorboards, right? So I've got these crusty old floorboards and you can see they really are crusty and old. So the plan is to clean them up with nails in certain places. They were actually, these nails were holding some hardboard down. Probably get rid of a lot of this just with a scraper. Save chowdering up my plate. Oh, yeah. I've got a bin down there, I'm not scraping it straight onto the floor. Hey, they don't make them like that anymore, folks. Excellent. Right, so if I shoot over to workshop now, yeah. I can pick up all the stuff from Screwfix. Yeah. Brilliant. Bye. All right, well, thank you. Bye. Bye-bye. Bye. This is a good example of why it's always been difficult for me in the past to vlog because I'm sketchy. I jump from one project to another. The stuff's ready at Screwfix. I've just quickly tidied the bench up. We'll revisit this tomorrow probably. They just need sanding and making looking nice like that. We'll pick that project up tomorrow. If I've got time, I'm gonna get my tools, man. We're just going to drop chancy pants off so I can go across the workshop and I've got room in the back. Oh, more prezzies! Right, she's giving me rotor, rotor for the pub, cashing up sheets for the pub. Throw these down there and go to workshop. 
Excited! Woo! Well, as soon as I'm going to pick gifts up today, I am feeling kind of guilty that Gemma's not got any, you know? Oh! Flowers for the back seat. Prosecco. Put it in the back. I think we're on to a winner there, folks. A wrap of the day for lunch. Mm. I'll tidy that up later. We've loaded up from the tradesman's entrance and we got tackle in the backle. There it is folks. What we've all been waiting for. The Titan. The Titan table saw. The E Bauer 2100 watt router and the Titan 750 watt fucking angle grinder. All right, maybe not so much the angle grinder. Uh, but we also got carriage bolts, nuts and washers, multi-pack, stainless steel bolts, nuts and washers, eh? Marine grade, I believe. Half inch router bits, 15 piece set. That's 40 quid on its own, man. So what do we open first? Let's do the angle grinder. Yes. That's important. The stay on, stay on switch. Because I fucking hate having to hold them. Wow, look at the length of this cable, man. It's about three metres, maybe four. Right, every grinder I've ever had, I've always lost the... Uh, the tool that you use to take off the blades. So to prevent losing it, ever, just like that, we will never lose it again. Oh, that's novel. There's another blade guard. How oh, you get another blade guard, an even bigger blade guard? That's good. That's an excuse to Keep the box then, isn't it? It's the table saw. Oh man. Okay. okay. Uh, this, I think, is going to take some building. There we have it, ladies and gentlemen. What do you think to it? On its stand, looks pretty good to me. I'm happy with it. So what I have to do is bring this table, you can see, it's not quite the right height. So I'd like all the tables to be exactly the same so it can just skim onto there. So I'll just pop some little blocks on the legs just to give it an extra inch in height. And I think she's gonna serve as well. Okay, I don't have long, folks. Gemma has rang me. Stuart's asked her to cover at the pub tonight, Tuesday night. She's starting at seven. I need to get ready to go home.